My name's Tyler Clark, founder here at 7K Distillery. Here to talk to you a little bit about our Tasmanian Raspberry Gin. So what is Tasmanian Raspberry Gin? Where does it come from? What's it made up of? How's it made? I think it's about time that we let the cat out of the bag and dissect this little product here. The raspberries that make this gin are all grown here at Westaway in southern Tasmania. So our Clark family has been in the Dewan Valley, close to Westaway for over 150 years. My dad though was the first person to buy a little bit of it and, and, and start a farm with an agricultural degree. As a 15 year old, he said to me, can you sell some of these raspberries? So that's when I started my business 25 years ago, selling a small number of little punnets of raspberries into a few green grocers down in Hobart and from there the business has grown and grown and grown. Now we grow over 400,000 kilos of, of fruit each year and supply about 150 to 200 customers across Australia making a wide range of beautiful products from our mechanically harvested fruit. We've been working with 7K for nearly five years. We started with a 20 kilo batch of raspberries that sent down, made beautiful gin, using a really good heritage variety of fruit that's grown in fertile river plains of the Tyana Valley. I think those two things really blend well and are obviously making a really fantastic product. We grow a variety of raspberries called Willamettes. They come from the northwest of the US. They're dark, they're rich in flavor, they're juicy terrible for a supermarket because they've got a short shelf life, they're small, but they pack a bunch of flavour. So it's really important that the variety of raspberries that you use is one of those processing heritage varieties that are full of those characteristics that are then infused into your product. When you're mechanically harvesting, the machine doesn't pick off all the fruit, it just picks up the really ripe ones, the ones that want to fall off and that the vibrations of the machine encourage to drop onto our catcher plates. They make wonderful products. They make wonderful jams and juices and liqueurs, ice creams. I've been amazed at the growth of 7K that's grown alongside us. We're now doing two and a half, three thousand 3,000 kilos of raspberries. It's amazing. 